Welcome to Cairo Movement Muscle and Joint Clinic. In this video, we are demonstrating how to implement an exercise that is based around stabilizing the core. This exercise is going to use two different resistance bands. It doesn't really necessarily matter that they're different, but more that you can see how we're just putting them together as just a simple square knot, or you can do it any way you'd like. But how this works is we're gonna put this around a weight down low on the ground. The reason we are using this exercise is it is important to learn how to stabilize our spine when needs be, especially with a lifter that is doing the exercises, including bench press, squat, deadlifts. They really want to be very tight and very strong. And to demonstrate what that means is if I'm here and also think someone pushes me here or tries to twist me and my back is strong enough to help re fight that, uh, I'm much more like less likely to get injured in my low back. So a lot less muscle strains, a lot less disc related issues. So again, we use this to help prevent injury. So let's show you how we set this up and then we'll demonstrate the exercise. So we have the bands wrapped around a weight down low. Uh, it works well for this exercise. So all you do from here is you open up this part. I'm going to slide my left hand, which is opposite of the side that it's pulling around through the band. So it's going to be up through the shoulder, make it tight twist and twist. It's going to wrap around your body in a couple different areas. But as you see, it's pulling me towards left rotation right now. So all I'm going to be at work on now is either positions much like a squat to fight being rotated or even a deadlift. Now, if you want to get fancy, you could put a weight down a kettlebell in front of you and do this. Uh, one other way of using this is shorten it up just a little bit by taking some of the resistance off. Now I'm a little bit closer to the, to the end of it. All I'm going to do from here is just march in place. What does that do is it is pulling me always into that left rotation. But every time I step or step or step, my low back, my glutes, my legs, my hips have to stabilize me from being pulled into that left rotation. So again, I can step, 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 step. Okay. My name is Dr. Bird with Cairo Movement Muscle and Joint Clinic. If you have any questions on these exercises, please reach out and let me know. I'd be happy to help. One of my biggest goals is to make sure that you as an athlete or even as an everyday person can have exercises and uh, strategies to build strength, to stabilize your spine, to be strong, and hopefully not get injured. So if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. I'm more than happy to help with anything that I can. Thanks for watching and have a good one.